Hello, how are you? I hope you're well. I hope you're managing, keeping your bodies moving and you're not too uncomfortable and you haven't got too many aches and pains and I'm sorry I haven't been able to see you. Uh, but I am now able to see emergency osteopathic patients and hopefully very soon I'll be able to work uh, through the, the procedural changes and invite back uh, normal patients who need treatments. During lockdown, I have been providing telehealth appointments. Um, so if people have been in pain, I've been able to talk about their problems online like this, do some examinations. I've been able to screen conditions, advise on how to manage it and send rehabilitation exercises with some funky new software that I've bought. So that's, that's been at least helpful for some people who've needed it. Um, and the last few months we know has included a lot of changes for osteopaths. We've been going through a lot of CPD to understand what it is that will be required of us to keep you safe. And it's also made me look at some of the services that I can offer you. So before appointment, if you do make one, I will ring you up so we will talk through the whole procedure first. I have to go through some screening questions regarding the virus and I have to offer you a remote consultation first. Um, then I will walk you through the changes of how it's going to be just a little bit different, nothing to worry about. Um, and that's the time when you can ask me lots of questions and I'll do my best to answer them. It, it's pretty straightforward. But I just want to reassure you, you need to know that all the rooms that you will have access to will be thoroughly clean before you come in. And when you leave, I will thoroughly clean again so that the next person, and I will leave an appreciable gap between people so you won't meet anybody, uh, makes it possible for me to do that. I've removed uh, couch covers and towels, um, furniture, and all sorts of extra things so that there's less to wipe down and less to clean and be a, you know, a vector for transmission. I will wear a gown and a mask and gloves because that's an extra layer of protection and that's in line with um, Public Health England's guidance. I have a mask for you if you'd like to wear, on, wear one or bring one yourself, just for that extra layer. Um, I'll ask you to arrive on time and wait outside in the car and I will escort you in so you won't have to touch anything. I'll ask you to wash your hands um, with soap and water or sanitizer, and, and you'll be the only person in the clinic with me. Please bring some water with you as I won't be able to serve you any and as few additional belongings as possible would be great and you can pay with my cardless, um, contactless card reader or I can send you a, a bill online. And I've kept all of these procedures and many more that I don't need to go into but you can read for yourself just as part of the procedures we have to do to keep you safe. And I will me email you those beforehand so that you can read them in your leisure and have any questions prepared for me so that your visit to me is as enjoyable as always. Um, there have been some other changes I've done too. Been a busy bee, as usual. Um, I've automated my mailing system so I can keep you up to date and informed of things that change because they are constantly changing. Um, but if you don't want to receive those mailings, then it's absolutely your right just to unsubscribe by clicking that little link at the bottom of each email. Uh, it's important that I tell you that too, because that's GDPR rules. I've bought new exercise software that I alluded to earlier, which is very easy to, uh, to use. You get um, uh, the text explanation, you get a picture of a lady or a gentleman doing the exercise, and you get a link to a video, and it comes with information sheets too, so I'm finding that very useful for people. It just gets better rehabilitation um, access for me to you, going through the stages of, of you know, acute pain to up and going again. Um, and we've done Zoom consultations as well with people, just like this. And you might prefer to use that as rather than come into the clinic if you've got to protect people at home. Beside, uh, beside that, I've got a YouTube channel when I put some free videos on there. You've probably seen some of them. And I've been also excited to create and research a program on supporting your immune health, which isn't finished yet. I work on it every evening to get it ready for you as quickly as I can, but I'll let you know when that is ready as soon as possible. I think that's about it. So 
Thank you very much for listening and I look forward to supporting you and helping you whenever you need it. Just let me know. Give me a call. Thank you.